Good morning, everybody. How are you today? Um, today is a very special day because we get to talk about something that happened to Jesus. So I'm really excited. Are you ready to pray? Put your hands together and let's get ready. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Loving Father everywhere, listen to my little prayer. Help me smile and do my best when I learn and play and rest. Thank you, God, for loving me and for friends and family. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Okay, so are you ready? Let's count. Let's get that kitty paw going and let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight, twenty nine, thirty, thirty. Say it. Thirty one. Very good. Oh my gosh. Is today the last day of the month? <gasps> it's thirty one. Today is March thirty one. And today we say goodbye to March. Everybody say goodbye and a count of three. Say it. Yes, goodbye, March. Tomorrow, I'm so excited because we get to put April on the calendar. And we're going to remove all these numbers and we have to start counting again. Okay, so now let's do the days of the week. Here we go. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. There are seven days. There are seven days. There are seven days in a week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So if yesterday was uh, Monday, what comes after Monday? <clears throat> Say it. Good job, Tuesday. And Tuesday begins with the letter T. And the sound that the letter T makes is T, T, T. For Tuesday, let's put the monkey on Tuesday. Oh, look, today also begins with T. That's awesome. Okay, let's do the, no, not the weather. We have to count. Let's count. Because remember, we have to get ready for that party. So here we go. I'm going to pull them all out from the tens and all the ones from the ones. And 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. And 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Next week, we're going to start counting by fives. Oh my gosh, big challenge. Okay, so you ready? Let's do this. 10, 20, 30, 40. Whoops, fell out. 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86. Oh my gosh. Are, can we have our party yet? No, not yet, but very soon because we are now at 85. I'm so excited, right? Okay, so now let's go see how the weather is today. Oh my gosh, more flowers on the tree and the sky is blue and beautiful in Seattle. Okay, let's fix the chart. All right, we're going to spin it around and spin around and put it on another beautiful sunny day. I get so happy on sunny days. So today the weather is, say it. 
Yes, today the weather is sunny. Okay, and what is the sound that the letter S makes? S, 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 s. And what is the sound that the letter S makes? Yes, and today I'm really excited because today we get to read a story about Jesus, something really special to happen to Jesus. So wait just a second right here while I grab my book. Miss Cecile's grabbing her book and she's grabbing also her little poem, her little poem today. Okay, so... This is the story that we're gonna read today. Are you ready? Look at the pictures. Did you see that? So I see Jesus riding on a donkey. And then I also see lots of people with beautiful palm leaves. Oh my gosh. And then also, not only, they, it looks like they laid palm leaves on the road where Jesus was walking. Do you see that? And not only palm leaves, but some of them even took off their robes, their coats, and they put them on the ground where Jesus was walking. Well, let's read what happens. On Sunday, on Sunday, is, we are going to celebrate Palm Sunday. So this is why Mrs. Castillo is reading this story for you. And the story is called, Jesus Rides into Jerusalem. Bring that donkey to me, Jesus tells his friends. They bring the donkey to Jesus. They put their cloaks on the donkey. Do you see Jesus riding a, the donkey? Look at him right there. He will ride into Jerusalem. Crowds of people come and they spread their cloaks on the ground. And they put palm branches on the ground. They want Jesus to ride on the cloaks and the branches that they have laid on the ground. Praise God, people shout. Jesus is the king. And this is exactly what happened on Palm Sunday, which is this Sunday. And this is why we're going to celebrate it today. Just so when that Sunday comes, you know, you wake up that morning and you know what Palm Sunday means. So I didn't have my palm. I don't have my palm today. So I made my own. I made, I put my hand on, brown, on green paper like that and I'm going to wave it. And this is what you're going to do with yours. On Sunday morning when you wake up, you're going to wake up and you're going to know you're going to learn this new word, a special word that mean, that says, Hosanna, Hosanna to the Lord, Hosanna to the highest. And Hosanna means hooray for you, praise you. And that's what it means. And so the word, the magic word today is going to be Hosanna. Ready? Now follow me because I'm going to teach you how to make this beautiful palm leaf that I made with my hand. It's so simple. All you need is a glue stick or tape, whatever you have at home. Remember, you're gonna need a pencil or a marker like Mrs. Castillo. You're gonna need scissors and you're gonna need green paper and it could be any green paper you find at home. Look, I got some from my printer. I found some in my <clears throat> in my bedroom that that was from a project and I found some old cardboard and this is the one that I wanted to choose to use. So whatever you have at home, and you don't, if you don't have green paper at home, a white sheet of paper, and then you can even color it green. It's all up to you. Look at this. It's so easy. I'm just going to trace my hand like that. I'm going to trace my hand. And then after that, look, I have my hand. And then you're going to cut it out. And then after you cut it out, then you're gonna glue it on a stick just like me. And then I want you to write the word of the week or of the day, Hosanna, praise be to God, hooray. <laughs> okay, so, and this will be your palm leaf. So, okay. I just wanna say, um, Thank you for wa watching these videos every single day. And the more you watch them, the smarter you're going to get. You're going to learn something new every day. Remember to be patient and kind to everyone at home. 
and um, a big hug from Mrs. White, Mrs. Frazee, and from me. Bye!